Good evening, Coastal Bend. I'm Brandon Schaff, and this is your three news sports report. Well, the high school softball season might be over, but some players are still staying busy on the softball field this summer. Dozens of players participating in a softball showcase over at Evelyn Price Park today, looking to be recruited as college coaches. Coaches were watching. To be able to bring uh, a group of college coaches, D1, D2, D3, NAIA, and JUCO coaches into the Coastal Bend for around 50 of these uh, potential student athletes is huge. Jay Aleman is recruiting director for Texas Lightning Fast Pitch, made up of softball players ages 16 to 18 years old. They travel the tournaments and compete in showcases like this one. Aleman said that these girls usually travel across the state for showcases, but with 14 coaches there on Saturday, including from UTSA's Division I softball program, they showcase their talent in Corpus Christi. Be able to work one-on-one -on -one with the athletes and um, just be able to see how do they respond to coaching, how do they respond to failure, um, what's their personalities like. UTSA assistant coach Tori Smith said the Corpus Christi area has many talented and hard working kids. She said that her program looks for resiliency and on-field performance, especially after the hard work they put in over the summer. After they've been tired, traveling, um, working, working on their trade is a great opportunity to come out and see, you know, what they've got and, and see what they, they can do at the next level. Players display different skills in the showcase, pitching, catching, and batting. There was also a 60-yard dash, the distance between home plate and first base, followed by a 90-minute game. Jody Armio is the assistant coach for Our Lady of the Lake University. He said that his team won the NAIA National Championship in May and can build for the future as they find new recruits in the Coastal Bend. The girls get the summer off, but it's it's really just uh, more time for them to get improve on what we did last year and get better so that we can come back even stronger. And Aleman says that they are planning to have another showcase in December and they plan to grow this event over time.